everyone, I have something to say, and we yet found it the person, behind the whole tacket thing. Oily. Tell everyone what happened. I uh, dad, please. I don't want to get in trouble. I didn't mean to. Go tell them the truth right now. Okay, it's over. I'll explain everything. I went outside and bought myself a pet tiger from a guy who was selling them for 500 bucks. And I bought one, forgot to put it in a cage. I was trying to show you guys the tiger, but then it went crazy and attacked Levi, Stinky Pete, Jafar, Raven, Evil Kaiu and so many other people in here, and I know for the fact now that this tiger attacked most of you, you're probably going to have to rest in the hotel while General Guy gets more jobs, and General Guy, I stole $800 from you to get the pet tiger. So I'm afraid you will have to earn it back in a different way now. Everyone, I'm so sorry about the tiger incident. Oily, why would you do this to us? Haven't you learned that you should never keep a tiger as a pet? Whatever that guy did with those tigers, he probably is gonna get arrested. Of course. I bet he kidnapped those tigers just to sell them for money. Oily, you never, ever, keep those type of animals as pets. They can seriously bite you. Now, I have to be on the wheelchair because my bag is hurting to death. The tiger actually cut my bag half apart. I really don't think this is gonna be good for me. Now when I watch General Guy and his future jobs, I can't stop customers from beating him up. Yeah. Oily, do you know that I can't heal people who actually lose bodies parts? Like if your arms comes completely off, or you get your back crack wide open. I, I can't reverse that. Now Sean saw Willivan's Barney and Stinky Pete have to live the rest of their lives without an arm in the back. I'm going to have to get a really really intense master wand. Oily, you could've gotten us killed. Seriously Oily. I needed all these troublemakers to be a part of my gang. And don't worry guys who didn't lose a body part, I'm gonna heal you right now. Alright guys, there you go. You're healed again. Now, Sean Sylvan's Barney, I'm gonna try to heal you, if I can't. I don't think there's nothing I can do. General Guy, it's not working. I'm afraid you'll have to go to your next job without me. I'm so sorry man, I tried. But again, I can't reserve body parts that actually get removed. Trust me guys, we are never gonna have tigers near our sights again. And Oily, you better go to your room right now and don't ever come out. And I'm also making sure you don't leave, because I will be locking your room. Now go. Guys, I'm sorry I didn't notice this really, I wish I could've been there to see what was wrong, and I feel very bad for you, Sean Swillings Barney, and I can't believe Stinky Pete has to live forever without her arm. Well don't worry guys, I know a place where they sell master wands. And when I get those, Sean Sylvans Barney and Stinky Pete can watch me serve the customers in the 92nd job. But for now, I want you to keep control, we now have our police officers standing outside being our security watchers. So that this doesn't ever happen again. And trust me, your son isn't gonna even think about bringing a tiger here in our sight again. I know. Well guys, I'm going to try and get some sleep. So general guy, when are you going to your 91st job? I'm not sure yet. But I'm gonna think, and hopefully more troublemakers will come. Oily's lucky that I'm not gonna assault him to death. But if I ever hear about him bringing wild animals on our sight again, he's dead. General guy, it's okay. Everyone, just calm down, that tiger is gone now. And I hope Stinky Pete and you, Sean Sawwillip and Barney take care of yourselves. Let's go.